1600 and they sent on their journey. Saipan jumped well on the outside, the yellow cap. Gold Lightning is right there into the first turn. El Bolero also looking to show some speed. As we drop back to Backpacker, only two and a half lengths off, ulterior motive, the red cap. Jolly Boy's a little bit free between runners. And then we drop back to Pure Quality, Wiley's Choice. Elogio towards the back end of the field, Backers towards the inside, and King Mouse has dropped out of it. El Bolero, just about the leader. Saipan's alongside the yellow cap. Gold Lightning saves ground to the inside. Let's Blaze is four around. Backpacker between them, they are stacked up. Jolly Boy at the eight peg. Ulterior Motive, Red Cap. Then comes Wiley's Choice trying to get a little bit closer. Backer towards the inner. Elogio and King Mouse the trailer. 600 metres left to go. A line of three. El Bolero, Saipan, Let's Blaze. Gold Lightning in the blue towards the inside. Backpacker's going to look to make up some ground, and Ulterior Motors got the red cap, hunts to the inside. Coming to the 300, and yes, Let's Blaze with a big run. Let's Blaze comes into the lead. Gold Lightning's running on. All the time, Backpacker's looking to unwind Ulterior Motive. Let's Blaze by a length and a half, and that's probably where he's going to stay now. Let's Blaze and Serena Mudley go on for the win. Let's Blaze to win by three. Backpacker second, Gold Lightning third, Ulterior Motor fourth. So number 11, Let's Blaze. Lazan Forbes, the Villiers again at it, Serena Mudley, and they win comfortably in the opener. Three lengths, Backpacker second, Gold Lightning third, Ulterior Motive, Quartets, El Bolero, Wiley's Choice. Jolly Boy. So down the middle of the course, Let's Blaze was four around them, but he comes into the lead and then just runs around slightly. Backpacker looks to stay on, and the rest of them going up and down. Let's Blaze, that's it for the first race. Back to the studio. Well, it's a good start to the race meeting for Lazan Forbes and Serena Mudley, and it's the colours of Mr. and Mrs. Uh, Falun. Uh, uh, that's uh, Sunet and Basi. Well done to them, uh, son of Lateral. Uh, yeah, he had some. Well, it's a nice start for to the race meeting for Lazan Forbes and her team, Serena Mudley. Well done to the Falunes, uh, of course. Uh, Zet and Barsi, and uh, we also congratulate the breeder, Mr. Saudi, as well, with the son of Lateral, who's come through here to win race number one. And uh, Tash is going to be doing the interviews for Lazan. She's firmly part of the team. Congratulations, Tash, and Stable's having a good run. Yes, it is. It's nice. The horses are coming along nicely. Um, I'd just like to say congratulations to Mr. and Mrs. Fuyun, and thank you for your patience. Um, this horse is a quirky horse, and it's a team effort um, to get him to where he is today. And um, I'd also like to say special congratulations to Steve. Um, he does a lot of work on the horse, and he calls it his horse. So big congratulations to him and to Moods. Thank you for all your hard work. Coming back uh, to the race itself, he, he had some good form to recommend. Yes, yes. Tash, before you leave us, anything else the stable fancies later on? Um, boom, Paper Sky finished strongly last time, so hoping she finishes close up today. Thanks for that, and give our best to Lausanne as well. Thank you. Lovely. Serena continues his good success, uh, whether it's for Lausanne, a stable that he's very close to these days, or other yards, and a nice start to the meeting. Yes, it is. You know, it was a great start. I actually fancied him quite a bit. You know, his earlier form was pretty good, and I'm just glad he did live last today. You were not shy to race him wide? Yes, you know, he's also, he's, he loves to race up hand, you know, and uh, you see last time he came from a bit off them, and uh, he seemed to finish very strong. But today, in the kickback, I don't want to be too far off. That's why I opted to race too deep, you know. He's kicking up quite a bit the poly, and he, he proved the tick today. Lausanne Stables in excellent form. Yes, you know, you can't do it. I've got the team behind me and they do, they do an excellent job, Mrs. Forbes and Tash and Steve. They, they do a sterling job back, back at home with these horses and uh, I'm just glad to be part of a team like this. Were you surprised that you raced wide and down the straight you actually found another gear? He, he was running all the way to the line 
No, not these. I wasn't worried at all. It was my plan to race too deep in this race. And then it just, you know, if I got in, it was by luck. But I always want to be one of the fans, especially with the poly kicking up like this today, you know. And uh, once again, to Mr. and Mrs. Falloon, they've been good supporters of mine. Massive thanks to them. Well, these days, you're certainly a man to follow. Uh, what you like later on? Look, I thought I had decent ch chances, you know. It was like Adel Tessima ran well last time. Uh, Bone Paper Sky is working very well back at home. She, she uh, should shoot the 2,000 meters. And, uh, yeah, that should be my next two best. Well, uh, thanks for that. And to yourself and all the boys in the jockey room, wish you all the best for the rest of the evening. Thank you so much. Okay, that's it. And then uh, the winning groom, uh, his name is uh, Masi Bulele, and uh, he's receiving uh, his 1,000 rand from our very own Olivia Naidu, race day promotions officer. So well done to uh, Masi Bululu receiving his 1,000 rand. He takes care of 11. Let's play. If you caught this quartet in race number one, the numbers you'll need will be 11, 10, one and two, and uh, that's the bipod done and dusted. Up next will be the start of the place accumulator.